guest with us today. It's the new vice chair of the California Democratic Progressive Caucus. It's Mark Van Landwood is with us. Hi, Mark. How are you? Greetings, Jimmy. And uh, it's the uh, Northern Districts okay, uh, Progressive so you're the Caucus vi- vice chair. You're the vice chair of the Northern Districts Pro- Progressive Caucus. That's right. All right. Woo. Oh. Woo. Well, that's Quite nice, though. So, so in no- politics, the longer the title, the less the power. So, <laughs> yeah. no- so, so you want people who are Democrats mm-hmm. to show up to vote for progressive Democrats as their delegate to the Democratic Party. Yes. And Republican, you can register Democrat on that day to vote and... and- and, and register Democrats. It really matters. And it tells you what district you're in, and it tells you where to go vote, right? That's right. And so I time. have to go all the way to frickin' Claremont. So they do this on purpose. Now, the people in uh-huh. District 1, those poor folks have to, like, some of them have to have to drive seven hours to get to their polling location. That's ridiculous. It is ridiculous. So here's the thing. With and ADIS. that's by design. It is by design. All this energy. Uh, uh, oh, yes. So let's... So I, I will do it again. I will do this. Uh, uh. I'm going to get out of bed and I'm going to drive frickin' 30 minutes or whatever, however far it is. It's about Claire, an hour. About an hour mm. to Claremont so we could go vote. Frickin' hour. So, um, but all this energy. Why am I poisoned? Why am I toxic? And so I have to go all the way to frickin' Claremont. So people say, oh, it's so hard to form a third party, you could never win. You don't need to win with a third party. You need to have 5 or 10% of the vote. So then the Democratic Party needs you to join them in a coalition government so they can at, then get power and win at the ballot box and B, have power so they could pass legislation in the House. So, so you want people who are Democrats... Mm-hmm. To show up to vote for progressive Democrats as their delegate to the Democratic Party. Yes. So you don't need to win. You don't need to win presidency. You don't need to win. You need to have five to 10 percent polling of your party. And then you have real power. Um, Bernie Sanders had 13 million, 13 million people on his mailing list. That's a third party right there. So but this that's not what this is about. So, Jimmy, I would say that the progressives inside the party, ostensibly, we are the third party. Yeah, I know. That's why. Yeah. But I, I get it. Yes, we are. I, and we're so, winning. But here's what I want to third... tell you. The progressives, we are winning. <laughs> so the Medicare for All caucus in the Congress, we've got over 70 members now. And in terms of putting the Green New Deal, that's on the, that's on the national agenda now. We're winning. We are winning. The world... Be part of this victory. Adems.vote. Come out and vote A-dems. these two weekends. Vote. Be part of this victory. Be part of this victory. That's right. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go vote for progressives to take over the Democratic Party. 